Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Bravely Default 2. Last time we left off, we went to an area we'd never been before, but I'm pretty sure we were supposed to go to earlier, but I never saw the quest thing for it. We also found out that we could get like, I think it was like five level ups after one fight, if our gambler proc goes off well. God, that was crazy. So yeah, let's go in here, check on our boat. What you got for me? Small JP orbs. Booster bun MP, that's nice. Booster bun HP. Mostly gonna be booster. Okay. Some small JP orbs, whatever. Physical attack. And okay, what is it? <clears throat> oh shit. Damn it. Why doesn't it just automatically start exploring again? Why do I gotta tell it to start exploring again? There. There. There we go. There we go. I guess in case people don't want to have to deal with that or don't want to use it, but then couldn't you just, like, disable it permanently or something? I, I don't know. So, we got some items here. <clears throat> Booster bun for HP. Gloria, you need it. Booster bun for MP. Elvis. Physical attack, we know who. And small JP orbs. So... I think I'm just gonna use these on Adele. Just to finish her off on Beastmaster as quickly as possible. There we go. So now, the other reason I came back here is I wanna uh, play some Airbnb with people. So... My dad gave me these cards. I suppose we could try playing with them. Oh, I'm about to steal... Oh, I'm about to steal this, this kid's cards. I should feel horrible, but I don't. Okay, so... Hmm. I think I'm gonna take the Sahagan out. And... What we are going to do instead... Is... I want to give... The Black Mage a shot. Now that I've seen some uh, AI use it, I wanna, I wanna give it a try. Let's see what this thing's all about, so... <clears throat> Let's see what we can do with this. And look, we got two Adele cards in here now. Let's play with this deck. And yeah, I want to see if I can utilize this well or not. So we go first. So I'm going to place it right up here. So there's like basically no chance of it being taken. They're going to have to neutralize it if they want to get rid of it. Which they can do, I suppose. Which would which does make this card... Less good. <clears throat> um... So let's go ahead and do this. <clears throat> so we neutralize that, which means we get a square. Wait, what? What? I thought we got a square because we neutralized. Every square neutralized during your turn results in you occupying a square above this card's base square. Ignore neutralization is caused by this card's effect. Wait, what? Okay, wait, didn't the AI put their card right there and it worked going down, but when I put the card there, it doesn't? Is that what's happening right now? <laughs> Have I been bamboozled? What's going on here? Because didn't the AI in that battle I showed last episode use the card at the top and it still worked? Or am I crazy? I could be crazy. I'm willing to admit that I might be insane, but I don't feel like I am. Whatever, let's just destroy this little kid. <clears throat> just fill the board with Adele's face. Ow. Don't like that. Um. Mm. Let's see, if I put this here, I'll get that. Yeah, sure. Oh, Black Mage, okay. I'm pretty sure that's how it worked for the AI, right? Like, I'm not crazy. There wasn't, like, a different effect for their card or some shit. Okay, and you got rid of my extended effect with your white mage. Cool. There we go. Boom. Get annihilated. Okay, that's fine. Thank you. Cool. Alright, so... See, I'm glad I tried this out first. Ooh, Freelancer. 
The long game cannot be strengthened until card binder is complete, at which point it is permanently strengthened. Wow. Okay, so once we complete our card binder, that, that card's just busted. Which seems kind of pointless once you get to that point. Okay, there we go. Goblin Chopper. Boom. We got all your cards. Yep, complete additional rules. <clears throat> okay, so let's quit and... I'm gonna find somebody else to play and I'm gonna give that Black Mage a shot again. Because I'm not crazy, right? P please tell me if I'm crazy. Because I'm pretty sure the AI placed it and when they neutralized the, at the top and when they neutralized the square, they got a square towards the bottom. So, I'm just trying to make sure I'm not going crazy here. And believe me, if I'm going crazy, channel's done. I, we, we can't have a lunatic running a YouTube channel. Okay, so we've beaten you. We've beaten you. Wasn't there another? Yeah, you. You're another rank C. You'd like to play against me, would you? Well, why not? Hehe. <laughs> Alright. Taking all those cards, lady. Give me all your shit. The battle commence. Okay, so we're gonna put the Black Mage at the bottom this time and see if it works. Luckily, we play first again. Yeah. Okay, let battle commence. Your turn. Black Mage, let's put it down here, sure. Okay, now it should work whenever I neutralize a square, right? Uh, Lady Emma, effect Scorched Earth, poisons one square at random at the end of each player's turn. Extended effect triggered when placed. Okay. Oh, that sucks. Okay, and what does poison do again? I don't remember what poison does. You, no, 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 no. Go to board, view details. Shit, what does poison do? I don't remember. I think it, like, in a few turns that space just dies. Which, if that's the case, we need to take care of this, like, now. Let's neutralize this. We neutralize the square. Boom. Okay, see, that time it worked. Why did it work the other way for the AI? I don't understand. That's weird, right? That's weird, right? Okay, so... We'll go ahead and steal your shit by doing that. Okay, yeah, and that card's gone now. Okay. Weird. Very weird. Strength is all humanoid and spirit cards. Well, I do have a spirit card right here. Ooh. Um, hmm. I want you, because if I get rid of you, I just win, right? Yes. And if I place this right here, I should just win. No, I don't think it was past turn five. Never mind. But you have zero spaces on the board, so... Okay, never mind. Now you got a lot of spaces on the board. Um... Let's just do... this. I would neutralize those two. I want to steal them. There we go. It's whatever. You're not in any danger of beating me. So, it is fine. And... put you up there. Alright, well I want your Lady Emma square. That seemed... I mean card. That seemed pretty good. I like the idea of that. Wait, how do you not permanently lose? I thought that was the whole thing. Or was that- oh, was that one of the rules you could put in? Yeah, that was one of the rules you could put in. Wipe out. Never mind, I'm crazy. Ah, I want you, though. That's a good card, I feel, if you get it down early. Well, no, because doesn't it take, like, three turns to actually kill something with poison? Hmm. I mean, I still want it. Get me wrong, but... Sure, give me the grizzly bear. And we are going to rematch you. Okay, we go second this time. Yeah, I want to give the Black Mage another shot. It feels like it's hard to use, just because I'm not neutralizing squares that much. I'm mostly just taking them. Capturing them. So... This doesn't feel super useful. But whatever. Let's place you right there. Yup. 
Alright, so it'll be really good with Horton, I feel. But I wonder if you can proc the effect twice in one turn. Ah, uh, now you get... Oh, you randomly poison spaces too, so that means you can lose your own spaces. Oh, that sucks. Oh, that sucks bad. Oh, yeah, and it, it, you can proc it twice, so it is super busted with Horton. Okay, that's cool. So you can proc it multiple times per turn, so if you multiply- if you neutralize more than one square, you get extra squares for your Black Mage. Wow, that's fantastic. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna steal this from you, if you don't mind. I don't think you have another character card to place, but just in case you did. Mm-hmm. Ah, so, ah, so. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and hit you with one of these. Eat shit. You might be able to take some of my stuff, though. You have a pretty good position there. Yep. That's what I was worried about. Um... Boom. There we go. I think I'm still gonna win this. Yeah, I don't really think you have any chance of beating me. There we go. I just... I, I, I didn't, I'm not even looking at the board that much, because as long as I can win, I don't really care about how many points I'm getting. I'm just looking to win. So... When it's so obvious that I'm gonna win, I'm not gonna worry about making the best move. Alright, so I won all the cards. Yeah, Lady Emma doesn't seem that- I didn't- like, it did say randomly, but I didn't think it was actually gonna- You would actually be able to choose your cards, too. Plus, it just seems like it'd take a really long time for the card to actually have any substantial effect on the... ...battle. So, eh. Not crazy about that. And I bet old lady's the card master, right? The Airbnb master. Alright, is there anybody we can fight up here? Is there, there was no, there's nobody that wanted to play cards in the palace, right? There's just side quests. You don't got any more new uh, side quests for me, do you? Uh, play me in cards. Come on. Okay, you guys are all boring. Later. All fun and no game, I mean, all work and no fun makes Vernon a dull boy. Play B&D with me, you jerk. Alright, we're out of here. We've done everything here so we can finally start progressing. And we've beaten every person in Savalon, um, and Halcyonia, at least every rank C and B person, I believe. Because I have scraped both towns, I feel. So, yeah. Alright, so let's go ahead and get out of here then. We got a bunch of stuff to do. I just want to evade you guys. Don't worry about it. Alright, so... There's a bunch of treasure chests we're missing, but frankly, on the world maps, I'm not going to freak out about treasure chests too much, just because there's so damn many of them. So damn many. Hmm. Hey, big guy. How you doing? And then we got a little oasis over here. I would like to try and capture one of these undines because once again, they know White Wind. So I would like to be able to use White Wind. Um, uh, let's attack you twice. There we go. And you can just forage a bunch. Thanks to the Shuriken, Throwing Knife, Force Tooth, and Phoenix Sounds. Um, and you... Yeah, just do that. Money! Oh, I screwed that up because it requires BP. Whoopsie. Uh, you can forage a bunch more, though. Ah, high potion. Good. Okay, taming. Staggering swipe off the leash. So, capture. It has 61 HP, man. That just say capture failed. And you just healed up a bit, I think. What am I doing wrong? Like, this is Pokemon logic, right? Is it just have an incredibly low chance of actually working? You're not quite that many. Like, I'm starting to feel like it just has an incredibly low chance of actually working. Did you just say you suck? Thanks for the money. 
Okay, capture. A weakened monster. Chance of success is based on the target's remaining HP. The lower the better. Will not work on humans or more powerful enemies. You have 51 HP. Finally. Oh my god. Okay, the, the chances to actually catch them just seems kind of low. But alright, we've got that now, so... Do we have the blue mage-like stuff for that, I wonder? Like, I guess you gotta use off the leash, right? Which, does that release them after you use it once? I hope not. That would suck. Like, you get one use out of it and then you gotta capture them again? I'm hoping it means, like, once you got them, you got them for good. Because otherwise, that would just be rough. Hi? What the hell is happening down there? Okay, well that's where we gotta go, so let's not go over there yet. Let's follow up on some of this other shit first. Because, yeah, we do have a side quest over here that we gotta do. Mm. Repositioning my chair here. There's another one of those weird warp gate things. I'm keeping my eye on you, weird-ass warp gate thing. Okay, and this is the abandoned house we heard about. Oh, is this like a whole-ass dungeon? Oh, this is a whole-ass dungeon, but hey, you're a new enemy, come here! Party's feeling brave. Oh, hey, it's more VVs. Um... Okay, lost mageling. Bopped you a bit. Examine you. Okay. So, off the leash. Undyne. We have one, it says. Okay, so that must mean... Okay, that must mean exactly what I think it means. So, you have a limited amount of the things. Which sounds horrible. Because it was hard enough to catch that one Undyne. So, I'm not sure how I'm gonna feel about this. Oh yeah, you're silenced. Oops. Alright, just whack him a bunch then. Nothing better to do. All of our people are wearing- are using stabs except for Adele. Our physical damage is not very high at the moment. All right, and hello. So this is the mansion that guy was talking about. Well, I can see why he wasn't too keen to come here himself. If this place isn't haunted, I'll eat my hat. What's the matter, Elvis? Are you scared? Scared? Me? <laughs> Ach, no, lassie. And besides, where there's danger, there's treasure. That's what they say, right? Sure it is. Well, let's see what we've let ourselves in for, shall we? Let's. Okay, so what is this? Oh, is this a new room? I didn't realize that was going to be a thing that could even happen. All right, well, I don't I didn't finish exploring the previous room, so Yeah. All righty. Hey friend, I've already murdered you once now. Okay, maybe we should investigate this, because up the stairs... Seems like it's progress. Whoa, that white mage ability was amazing! Like, the super white mage ability, the second specialty or whatever. It said all of your healing spells affect all allies. What the fuck? That's so good. That is so good. Okay. Alright, so... yeah, this room. We were in here earlier. There's these little mage boys. Whoa, that treasure chest has already been looted? Why? Okay, this seems like a very confusing dungeon. If I do say so myself. Hey, you're new! Come back here! Okay, now we're fighting two new enemies. Um, alright, so... Let's just attack you. And let's attack you. And let's miscellany you. There we go. Dead, dead. 
Electrica element. Oh my god, it's one of you guys. What happens if you capture one of those? If you even can. Wiki Wiki has 91 HP. Oh, what the fuck? Um, what do we got in here? It's weak to Earth. Do we have any throwing sticks? We do. And then just whack the wiki wiki. Oh my god, those things are hard to kill. Are we serious right now? Whatever. Oh. Okay, went a, went a bit too hard there. Murdered them a bit too good. Whatever. Whatever. Alright, so... Is this big room? There's also this path down here. God, this place is confusing. Oh my god, I'm gonna get lost in here so much. Already looted treasure chests. More already looted treasure chests. Mm, more already looted treasure chests. I guess they did say this was like a place that's well known for having treasure, so there's probably people that have come here before us. We must make the most of this opportunity. Um Bop. Right. Let's see. Uh and then we'll whack you a bunch. Oh wait, I've already examined you, never mind. Alright then. Whoopsula doopsula. Martial arts. Uh damn it. No, I don't want any of that. I want the big AoE when we have the sweep or whatever. That's what we need. We need the big sweep. Alright, we're gonna crosscut you. Oh wait, I don't have enough for more than one crosscut. There we go. There we go, mow down. That is what I wanted. The Seth learned triples. But mow down is mostly what I wanted. God, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I love this game, but holy shit. Bravely default developers. Would, would it have really been so hard to put a mini map in these dungeons? I'm getting very overwhelmed very quickly. Just fire all you nerds. Oh, I should have captured you. Damn it. I didn't think about it. I could have tried, at least. It just seems like such a pain to capture them. And then you get to use them once and they're gone? Okay. Oh my god, there's a treasure chest. Like, don't even know where I'm at right now. Damn monster in a box. Come, let us fight. Oh, is that it? Well... Triples do. Okay. Yeah, no, I'm good. Um, let's do spin the wheel. Might as well get free money if it's offered, right? Uh, you have 280 HP. Sure, let's try to capture you. We'll see if it works. Oh wow, it actually works. What do you know? What do you know, everyone? It actually works. We got ourselves an Electrica element. Was I just having terrible luck with those other things? Lubu Spear. Wow, just... Getting a historical figure... So that... If Lubu Spear is here, that insinuates that... <laughs> that insinuates that Bravely Default takes place in the real world? Because how else is Lubu Spear here? Whatever. So you're good with spears, right? How much... Is this better than what you're... No. My god, your fists are really good, gal. And I don't have, like, another ability to give you right now, so it's honestly just worth keeping. Animal rescue. When an attack on the user reduces HP, yep. So, nothing crazy. And you have self-healing, JP up and up and up, and I just... I don't have anything better to give you. Because you haven't really learned a lot of passives, so we're just gonna keep you on bare knuckle, bare, uh, knuckle brawler for now. Hey, you better run. Anything? Electrica element? 
God, this place is confusing as all hell. There's only one other treasure chest in here. So, and I think I remember where it was at. So it shouldn't be too terrible, but god damn. Confusion is at an all-time high. No? Uh huh. Nope, that wasn't anything. Oh, hi. Oh, you were just this room that I've already been into. Wasn't there one There's like a dead end? Yeah, right here. There, that's what I was looking for. Oh my god. And then how do- is, does this place go up a level, or is that all that's in this room? Oh my god, it's adorable. It's a Kate Sith, and it's adorable. It's so adorable. I actually think that the way you're supposed to pronounce that, I've heard I've heard this on a documentary before talking about Final Fantasy. Um, it's like Katshi, Katshi, something 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 that it does not look like it should be. Basically, I remember seeing that and I'm like, I'm just gonna keep calling it Kate Sith. But uh, yeah. Um, so let's miscellany you and bop ya. Seven sixteen. Uh, sure, let's try. Probably won't work, but... Oh my god, it worked. Why is it working so consistently now? It's actually super consistent now. Four remedies is nice. Alright, so... Now let's go to the absolute top of this and see if there's, like, anything else we can get here. Wait, where does... Yeah, how do we get over there? How do you get over there? We might only be able to access that area from a different part of this map. That's what I will guess. God, this place is confusing as all hell. But we got the two treasure chests in here, so let's just leave. Let's just leave. And does that other one just lead to the same room? Because it's a pretty big room. It is a pretty big room over here. So... Do you just lead to the same thing, or are you a different place? Uh, yep, you're the same place. Okay. So we don't need to bother anymore with you. Okay. So... Boom. I'd like to capture one of these little mages. Use... Hey, friend. I just need to capture you for my collection. Are you feeling brave? Will should they be ready for this? Is that true? Capture. Okay. Well, that time we had horrible luck. Here we go. Ah, uh, they're gonna bop us. Pretty damn hard, mind you. Yeah, curse me all you want. Okay, there we go. Now, you're pretty low HP, so this should work this time. There we go. Got it. I like battle screams are so weird, Elvis. You just scream so hard. It sounds funny sometimes. I don't even know if this will kill, but... Barely. If I hadn't got that crit, I don't think it would've. That crit was a very lucky crit. Okay, so nothing over here, but where does this go? This is probably how we get down to that room that I saw. Which I don't even really know... Oh no, this is a totally different room. Alright, well I don't really need to fight you guys. With even more empty treasure chests. Okay, but there are some that aren't empty, so I guess I should grab those. I wonder if they just left all the ones that had monsters in them. Ooh, a star corslet. Okay. That sounds like... magic equipment? No? Unique stage outfit worthy of the most storied of performers. 
I mean, it's straight up better for you. Um, what about you? You'll be overloaded. It's better than your padded armor? Really? Huh. Wouldn't have guessed that. Take it. Sure. Wouldn't have guessed it would be better than the padded armor, but whatever. Okay, where does this go now? Oh, now we're over here. Well, this doesn't do anything for me, right? Because, yeah, this is a dead end now. Because we can't go back down this way. Okay, well, that was a waste. Weird. <clears throat> okay, but how do we get to some of these other places? Yeah, because the floor is gone right here. Oh my god, that's a crazy looking dude. Thing looks crazy. Whoa. Uh, Alright, I guess I'm just going to get out of here and we're going to go towards the actual objective now. And I hope some shit is actually going on over there. That I can follow up on. Hello. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, so what we got? We got some treasure chests in here. We got a staircase that leads down. Where is this going to show up? Well, there's nothing here. Oh wow, this is just this place. Okay, so this is where these staircases went. Damn it, I did not even mean to run into you. We've got the upper hand, guys. Uh, yeah! Just murder it. I don't even care about getting another electrical element. Let us continue on our way. Oh, cool. There we go. So now up. Berserker specialty, Pyrrhus default. Oh my god, that's what the Berserker specialty was? That's why he was kicking my ass. That's why he was kicking my ass, that asshole. Let's see here. Details. Yeah, so you, their, their passive is just that they Pierce default Berserkers. That's why Caster was beating the hell out of me. Okay, that, makes, that's, that fight makes so much more sense now. I was like, man, I'm defaulting, and he just annihilates me. And I'm, I'm, like, not realizing that that's the passive that he has. God. What a busted-ass ability for a boss to have. Just, just like, yep, I'll pierce your default. And I'll keep using my big AoE attack to absolutely murk your entire team. What a rude asshole. Okay, so... Okay. Move my mic back a little bit here. There we go. I'm trying to sit up straight here so, my, so I don't die of bad posture. Aha! This one's empty too! What the heck is going on? Huh. Looks like we've been sold up, pup. All the chests are empty. Have we been taken for fools? Nah, we just gotta keep looking, that's all. There's heaps of treasure in this old place, you'll see. And what grounds do you have on which to base such a claim, exactly? Well, where's the best place to hide your gum trees? In the middle of a forest. That's where. These empty chests are just decoys to stop us finding the goodies. And if someone's gone to all this trouble to hide them, these goodies are gotta be crash hot. An admirable conclusion. Even if it is based on exactly zero evidence. Evidence, evidence. Look, just trust me for once, all right? There's treasure around here somewhere, I just know it. Remind me why I continue to associate with such a nitwit. I don't know. Well, don't just stand there. Come on! The sooner we find that treasure, the sooner we can start living the high life. I just realized that's what you look like. You look like Groose. And you remind me of Groose. 
Head deeper into the abandoned mansion. All right, can do. Uh, I think that leads out, right? So, treasure. Hey, hey, run away. Be scared. Thank you. Nasty surprise. <clears throat> and any of the chests that do open are usually like booby traps. Ow. Um, gonna bop you. Deadzo. I want to catch a Kate Six. Gimme. I want my own kitty that rides a ball. Here we go. Whoop, Elvis is about to max out Black Mage. Which will be interesting because I have no idea what to switch him to after that, but whatever. Staff of Life. Ooh, is that one of the staffs where I can smack people with it to heal them? Effect when used, cure. Okay, so you just get free cures off of it. It would make you overloaded, though. Wand with healing powers. So I wonder if you hit people, does it also uh, do it, I think? Okay, if I lower you down to the Pilgrim's Robe, you'll be good. Weight-wise. So, there we go. Cool. And now you got a Staff of Life. Congratulations. Well, that was a good find, at least. A good ghetto. Oh, hey, a continuous battle. It's free JP, everyone. Bum, 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 bum. Man, you're fast. Have I ever told you that? You're quite fast, quite swift. Capture. I want another one. Yeah. That's fine. Oh, gravity would have actually hurt a lot. Okay, so it, it doesn't heal. It's not it's not like a healing staff, which is nice. I was kind of worried that's what it was going to be. That, like when we hit people, it was going to heal them. Because those staffs usually do show up in Final Fantasy. Um, honestly, just in a lot of JRPGs. Which, Bravely Default, is very Final Fantasy inspired, considering it used to be called Final Fantasy IV Heroes of Light. Before they were like, eh, Bravely Default. It didn't used to be called that, but it's basically what the first one was, the prototype to this series, I guess. Alright, so Black Mage is what you were rolling, uh, Elvis. And we've mastered everything there. Hmm. What do I want you to have now, then? Bum 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 Frankly, I don't know. Source the amount of HP based off the damage inflicted the attack command. When the user is healed beyond max HP, their max HP is temporarily increased. Huh. I mean, that's useful. Vanguard, Monk, it's of offense. Yeah. I'm get to you. God, there's really not a lot of things I would want you training for. Mm, I mean, it's gonna be something that. I guess I can make you my bard. I guess I can make you the bard. I, I don't know, man. Oh, wait, you have MP Saver. Never mind, you're gonna become a Beastmaster too. Never mind, you're gonna become a Beastmaster too, Elvis. I forgot it had MP Saver. Yeah, we definitely want that. So, we're gonna have two Beastmasters. That's his main job. Oh, he's adorable. Look at him. Oh, he got a little foxtail. Oh, that's great. Oh, that's great. Oh, that's great. All right, now the question is, what equipment do we want on you? So, your C with staves. But I could give you Lubu Spear. And that does raise your magical attack quite a bit, actually. So yeah, roll a spear. And then you got a round shield, you're wearing the turban, the manner of the feather mantle, and that. Alright, there we go. 
So Elvis is our new Beastmaster. Cool, cool. So let's go ahead and heal everybody up, actually. Auto heal. There we go. We should be utilizing that more often. Well, I'm glad we got Lubu's spear, and I'm glad I'm getting MP saver for Elvis, because then he'll just be able to spam shit as much as he wants. And some of those uh, higher level spells start to cost quite a pretty penny. And I think uh, Seth is the only one I want really screwing around with Gambler, just because it's kind of a joke. It's funny to me, and that's why I'm doing it. Where is this other treasure chest? Go away. Looking for another treasure chest, you dorks. Mm. Yeah, I just have like... Oh, there it is. But how do I... I don't think I know how to get over there. It's the problem. Oh, no, this way. Okay, and then... Oh no, we need to come from over there. Okay, never mind. Never mind, I was going the right way. This is this place is just a damn maze. It's just a damn maze. Bum 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 Go away. We gotta go down here, right? Oh my god. Can't you guys see I'm trying to do something? Uh, not the best start. Right, Me's feeling brave. Okay. okay. Up, 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 up. Right. Let's see. Oh yeah, I could have captured. I didn't think about that. Could have captured them. I'm going all in. Um. Now yeah, you're a little on MP, so just whack him a bunch. Alright, Elvis, how much damage do you do, friend? Not bad. And that spear does actually increase your magic attack, which is crazy nice, actually. Yeah, wail on me, whatever you want to do. Let's uh, actually try to capture you. There we go. Cool, cool. And we got a job level up. This is interesting. Two levels up. Two lo uh, job levels up for Elvis because he had just started off there. Yeah, I'll probably get to MP saver on Beastmaster and then just chill on Beastmaster for Elvis. But uh, it's very useful, and his magic attack really hasn't lowered that much from uh, like he can be a physical. He can be like a mixed attacker basically, which is nice. I actually quite like that. Freelancer especially stand ground. Yep, 50% chance of surviving. That'll be super busted for the late game bosses uh, when I have Seth as a freelancer because he'll be so incredibly busted because he'll have maxed like every single class. Alright, so just wanted to open that up. So, treasure. Nasty surprise. Nope, oh, mithril shield. Okay, um... Equipment. So, Mithril Shield. Eh. Physical attack goes down, physical defense goes up barely. Honestly, not even that great. Um, oh, it's also because you are apparently shit with shields. I did not realize this. I did not realize this at all, that you were shit with shields. Hmm. Maybe I should just have you on the bow. Eh, the iron bow's so shit, though. Oh, I'll leave you as is for right now. I forgot you were shit with shields. This is pretty good for you, though. More defense. Uh, less HP, though. Who else is using a shield? You? Okay, that's better for you. Yeah, I'll just pop it on you. Enjoy your new shield, Elvis. Okay, so... where are we going now? God, I love games that have job classes. Have I mentioned that before? I'm pretty sure I have, but if your game has job classes, chances are I'm probably gonna love your game. I'm playing Yakuza Like a Dragon on my own time now, and I'm absolutely loving it. 
because it also has job classes. Like, I just love the idea and concept here, of job classes. They're just so fun, damn it. I love them. Maybe a guy. Uh, I'm gonna examine you, and then we're gonna slap this cat, silly. 1830 HP, huh? Staggering swipe. Uh, oh yeah, I forgot to change you to Black Mage. Whoops. Don't but notice you're vulnerable to spears, friend. Um, spin a double wheel. Sure. I'm gonna try and murder you. He fires. Ah, we almost got him. I gambled and I lost. What can I say? That's fine. Now you're dead. Let us continue on our way. I want that big JP drop for a Seth or the XP drop. I got the money one a little bit ago, I believe, but I don't really care about money as much. Hey, big guy, don't worry. I, I might want to capture you though. It would be cool to capture you. Um. Uh, so let's do mow down. This might actually kill them all. Counter taming abilities? Interesting. Oh, yeah, you're vulnerable to spears. Let's whack you a whole bunch. And same goes for that. And then we're going to try to get Elvis to capture this thing. Yeah, that was big damage, actually. Come on, big man. Vishno, capture. I wonder if our Beastmasters share, um, like, their captured units or not? That's something I haven't really thought about, because I just captured it on Elvis, so I wonder if, um, Adele still has access to that? Go oh, away. Trying to see if there's anything back here. Can't fall down that. Alrighty. Go away, big man. Alright, so down we go. God, this place is a damn maze. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, and this is... Where exactly? I think this is where that, yeah, treasure chest was. Three high potions, I'll take it. Okay, and there wasn't anywhere for me to go over here really, right? I, mean, I can walk into this room, but there's not shit in here. Okay, so we just go over here. Get out of my way. All right, go away. Yeah, run away from me, stupid idiots. Fear me. Okay, so cool. We finally made it down here. Um, before we do that, let's go ahead and pop an old tent. Just sleep in this haunted house. I'm not sure. I'm sure that's not going to give anyone nightmares. Okay, and now we will save. Uh, boom. Man, how far we've come. Feels like I just started Bravely Default, but we're making some damn progress, we are. Of course, it is a very long game. Look, that must be the vase that... Huh? Wait, it's a haunted vase. What's it? <laughs> what the? It's a dusty old genie. Or gin. Okay. okay, well, I feel like this is probably going to destroy the vase, right? Maybe this dude just wanted me to kill this thing? Okay, that was... I, I thought that said 4,000. I was like, wait, what? But no, it did not say 4,000. Okay, so... Off the leash. So you do Thrash, Aurora... On ice? I don't even know what the hell on ice is. Whatever. It's probably an ice type attack, right? Let's just pressure point your ass. Let Big damage. Um, get the courage. Neo cross slash. Hey, buddy. Attack me. 
Okay, examine. Prepare to meet your to axes, huh? And that is it. And you have 18,000 HP, which frankly won't take a long time to get through. This is used restorative power. Honestly, just body slam it. It's some damage. Big blow. Yeah, that's fine. Or a physical attack on the target and significantly delay their next action. Only 164 though. Um, are you still provoked? Yeah, you're still provoked. So let's go ahead and hit you with an elemental wheel, why don't we? Seven Earth. Oh no, you're immune to Earth. Well, that's unfortunate. What's the plan? Okay. Um. I wonder if you're immune to fire. Let's try it. Okay, you're not immune to fire. Cool, and now your turn's come again, so... And you're defaulting, so... Eat shit. I don't care if you're defaulting. And we can enrage you again. You go ahead and cast the Cura on our boy Seth. And taming. Oh yeah, so let's check. No, um, off the leash. Okay, so no, we have access to the same repertoire of, uh, beasts. Cool. You are about to witness my true power. Okay, you just default. Uh, oh yeah, shit, I forgot to... Damn it, I forgot to put your shit back on. Body slam him. That's pretty good damage, actually. Uh, gaming. We're gonna go ahead and hit you with the elemental wheel again. Four null types. Eh. Alright, I guess. Better luck next time. Earth Pound? Oh, is that because that was an Earth Elemental thing and you have that shield on? Yeah. Sucks to suck, I guess, dude. Um, martial Arts. So let's do Flames of War. No, 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 not Flames of War. Uh, Firebird. And uh, then let's do Flames of War. Big damage. Oh, not enough HP. Damn it. I wasted that. I should have paid attention a bit more there. But, uh, yeah, you're weak to fire now. Do we have any off the leash things that do fire? Uh, not really, unfortunately. Just attack him, I guess. Hold up. Um, your defense is probably massively increased now, right? Yeah, it did one damage. Okay. You are about to witness my true power. Um, not really much for you to do. Chill. Same goes for you. He's giving us the opportunity to just kind of chill, so. That's fine. That's absolutely fine. Um, we could flash the cash at you, but I don't think we're going to. Uh, elemental wheel is what I want. Big money, big money. Oh no, you absorb lightning! Okay, this is just not a good time to be using that. <laughs> Alright, Seth, you're grounded from elemental wheels. Uh, oh yeah, let's do the stagger twice. There we go. Zero damage, good job. Hmm. When the will perform physical attack on the target, landing on the number in range will select in triple damage. Result in triple damage. Or we could just flash the cash. Let's just flash the cash. Eat it, nerd. What's the plan? That was pretty good damage, actually. Wow. Um. Focal blast. Perform an incredibly powerful physical attack on target, which will also reduce a random stat by 20%. Yeah. Ooh, that is big damage. Okay. Okay, I like that. We should be using that a bit more often, I think. Here I go. Let me Uh You know what? Spin the wheel. Let's see what you get. Yeah. Ooh, big money. Uh, it sucks that that doesn't scale though. Because that means the further we get into this game, the less useful that's going to be. Unfortunately. Okay, so we got enough for one focal blast. And then let's hit you with a firebird. 
a Flames of War, and another Flames of War. Big damage, big damage. Oh yeah, yeah, that hurt you a lot. Oh yeah, and your physical defense and your aim are down. Yeah, that Focal Blast is really good. Huh. Um, you got enough for two, so... Lower that turn a bunch. You are about to witness my true okay. power. Let's cast a Cura on you. Alright, this squad's working out pretty well. I wasn't sure how I was gonna oh, like man, having Elvis on that, but things are going pretty damn well. Uh just okay. yeah. You two. <laughs> you two. If he's a fall thing, there's no point. Supercharge. Okay, that was damage. That was damage. Was not ready for that. That's fine, though. Yeah, you did boost the hell out of yourself, I suppose. Your magic attack is plus 100%. That's why. Um, well, let's make sure your turn doesn't come anytime soon. I think we can just kind of bum rush you now and finish you off. Oh, yeah, you have your special. Sure. Pop it. Let the light ease your pain. <laughs> Big heal. Much work yet to be done. And on and on. Okay, so your primary defense is down. So how about we? How about we do triples? Let's go. Uh, I'll take four to six. And then seven to nine. Oh, we got it! Oh, that wasn't that much damage anyway. <laughs> okay, so don't use that. Got it. Alright, but you're dead. Because, um... We can't afford a Focal Blast, but... Uh, we can do... Some Flying Heal Drops, which will finish you off. Boom. And boom. Out of here. Damn it. I was hoping we would have got the big... The big boost. For Seth. I don't think we did. I don't think we did. It would have been nice to get that ridiculous amount of XP there. again. No one's putting that back together again. Hold on a minute. Crikey. Your mom wasn't wrong. This thing is ancient. It, it must be worth... Millions! No, more! Guess there was at least one real treasure here after all. Was being the operative world, well, die. It won't be worth much now we've smashed it to smithereens. What were we supposed to do? It had a monster in it! Well, what's done is done. We'd better head back to town and tell that guy what happened. Alright, let's go. Uh, is there anything else in here? Doesn't seem like it. Alright, it looks like this is just a fast way out. Alright, so, yep, that was just a fast way out of there. Yeah, you better run, you idiots. Coming through. Alright, so, I don't remember exactly what we were gonna get for this quest. I think it was some JP orbs or something, which I would take, happily. For sure. Because that sounds just damn dandy. Alright, we're almost back to town. And yeah, wow, that took a whole episode to get through that dungeon. That was a side quest dungeon. I gotta say, I'm very, very happy with the side quests in this game. Usually they're very interesting. I hate when you play a JRPG and it's like, go collect five of this resource from a monster. And that's like, all of the side quests. But this game's side quests are pretty damn neat. Like, they got, they got a lot of really cool ones mixed in here. That do uh, some pretty neat stuff. I noticed you guys' uh, water problem still isn't fixed. I guess they didn't make a version of the town that doesn't have the water overflowing it. I've still never found this damn treasure chest. I'm suspicious of this. No. Okay, never mind. Yeah, I just... I'm, I'm probably missing it, right? I must be missing it. It's hiding somewhere and I just have never seen it. Alright, dude, why'd you send us to almost get murdered by a genie? 
He was a little scary there towards the end, I gotta say. And there was nobody else here that wants to play me in B&D, right? Doesn't look like it. Alright, you're all boring. I've beat all you before. Especially you. And the vase is broken beyond repair, you say? Well, it cannot be helped. Thank you for your efforts, nevertheless. Uh, sorry we couldn't be more helpful, sir. I wish there was something else we could give you. Please, do not trouble yourselves. Do you recall that I also told another pair of people about the mansion? Well, they were able to retrieve this for me. A necklace? Yes. They gave it to me, no questions asked. It should be more than enough to cover the cost of my son's medicine. Why would they just give that to you, no questions asked? That doesn't seem like a very Selene or Dag thing to do. Wow. They sure sound like kind people. I hope I get to meet them someday. Irony. So our treasure hunt was a failure. A failure you decided to compound by giving away your lucky charm. Why would you do such a thing? I thought it was very valuable to you. Oh. Okay, Dag gave away his lucky charm thing. It was, but... Well, you saw the bloke's face. How could I not? Oh no. Is Dag a himbo with a heart of gold that we're finding out about now? His... face? This was enough to make you give up your treasure. Yeah. Why? Hmm. No reason. I suppose I shall just have to get used to this new... generous you. Oh, okay, so this isn't something that was there before. Uh, yeah. Too bloody right you will. Uh, anyway, uh... All this running about the place has got my feet aching, something chronic. They're like right over there, keep in mind, and our party is right on the other side of the room. It's amazing we haven't run into them. Show me, please. Dag, you're injured. Why did you not say something sooner? Uh, I don't know, I just, uh, you know. <laughs> Never mind. It was good of you to give your necklace away. And I am sure you will find another lucky charm soon enough. Yeah. Just, do not be so quick to give away the next one, will you? Yes, boss. Whatever you say, boss. Okay, and we got five small JP orbs. Not entirely worth it, but uh, it was a very cool quest, and we got to get some more characterization out of uh, Dag and stuff, so that was the main draw of that quest, I feel. So... We're gonna pop these on. I, I wish you could see like the max amount of JP you have on like all your characters. So I could see like who needs this the most. Gloria, do you really I mean you have the Bard class that you could be working on. Elvis didn't really have anything else to follow up on. Adele has many other classes to follow up on, so I'm gonna give it to Adele. I want her to max out Beastmaster and move on to something else soon. Okay, party chat, what you got? What's a ghost? So remind me what a ghost is exactly. It's different from an undead person, right? Aye, the undead are corpses reanimated using magic. Ghosts are supposed to be the spirits of the dead, but well, not a whole lot's known about them. I'm not sure they exist at all, you know. I suspect they're tricks of the light or figments of the imagination. There's no doubt that people start seeing all sorts of things when they're frightened. Lord knows I've done it myself. And plenty of scholars agree with Gloria. What we call ghosts might be nothing more than noises or shadows we can't immediately explain. Oh yeah? And how do you explain the story I heard? It's about this... Wait, are you about to tell us a ghost story? Yeah, it's a good one, I promise. All the sailors swear it's true. It's about this bunch of fishermen who found a ship way out at sea just drifting along. They were worried about the crew, so they decided to go aboard. Oh no, is this the ghost ship that's in every JRPG, including Bravely Default 1 that also had a ghost ship? <laughs> go. But no matter how hard they searched, they couldn't find a single soul. Then they heard a creepy voice. A v voice? And what did it say? You're not getting out of here alive. You're coming with me too. What? The sailors panicked raced back to their boat and got the heck away from the ghost ship as quick as they could. But just as they thought they'd gotten a safe distance away and started to wonder what they'd just witnessed, they heard it again. 
You're not getting out of here alive. You're coming with me too. I, um, gosh. No one ever saw them again after that. But they say the voice lives on. In fact, anyone who hears this story might also hear one dark and stormy night. Uh, ahem. Uh, all right, that's quite enough of childish stories for one day. Oh, poor Gloria. Huh? Something the matter, Gloria? Eh, you look like you've seen a ghost. Oh, she is scared. <laughs> that was a cute one. I like I like party chats. I like the like skits of some party parts uh, from Tales of Asperia. So having it basically added into this game. I'm absolutely 100% down for people ripping off good things from other games, because goddamn, it feels great. It feels great when you get just all the good stuff. Hmm. Chef's kiss to that. Okay, so... We're actually pretty hurt, so... I'm gonna go over here and hit the N up, and then I'm gonna go outside and save. And I guess next time we'll actually progress with the main plot again, finally. <laughs> feels like it's been forever since we've done some main plot stuff, although I did just get my ass kicked by... Um... Aster not too long ago, I guess, but yeah, I don't know. I, I didn't expect this entire episode to be taken up by one side quest, so I hope you've enjoyed, and I will see you next time.